Hello everyone, Playing With Power here. I'm Cameron. I'm Jerry. And it's time for more lyrics of Disney. Oh yeah. We're playing Caspian Lament of Innocence. That's <gasps> Fuck! <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> oh, you boring. motherfucker. <laughs> Who does she think she is? That girl has tangled with the wrong man. Darn right. What song no is this, says, you son of a bitch? You'll find out. No one says no to Gaston. Oh my god. Dismissed, rejected, publicly humiliated. Why, it's more than I can bear. More beer? What for? Nothing helps. I'm disgraced. Who, you? Never. Oh Gaston, my god, I'm never gonna get... Gaston, you pull yourself together. Oh. What? I keep falling. Oh. If we had kept going that episode, I would have had my rhythm. <laughs> Gosh, it disturbs me to see you, Gaston, looking so down in the dumps. Every guy here would love to be you, Gaston, even when you're taking lumps. There's no man in town as admired as you. You're everyone's favorite guy. Everyone's odd and inspired by you, and it's not very hard to see why. No one's slick as Gaston. No one's quick as this Gaston. Uh... No one's neck as incredibly thick as Gaston's. There's no man in town half as manly. Perfect, the pure paragon. You can ask any Tom, Dick, or Stanley, and they'll tell you whose team they prefer to be on. No one's been like Gaston, a kingpin like Gaston. No one's got a swell chest in his. No one's got a swell cleft in his chin, Gaston. I was about to say no one's got a uh, swell chest in his chin. As a specimen, yes. I'm All right, this is gonna get intense. So shh. Actually, you know what? Keep going. This will get fun. This will yeah. get interesting. My, what a guy that Gaston. Give five hurrahs. Give twelve hip hips. Gaston is the best, and the rest is all drips. No one fights like Gaston. Douses lights like Gaston. In a wrestling match, nobody bites like Gaston. For there's no one as burly and brawny. As you see me, I've got biceps to spare. Not a bit of him scraggly or scrawny. That's right, and every last inch of me's covered with hair. <laughs> no one hits like Gaston, matches wits like Gaston. At a spitting match, nobody spits like Gaston. I'm especially good at expectorating. Oh. Dewey. <laughs> Ten points for Gaston. When I was a lad, I ate four dozen eggs every morning to help me get large. And now I'm grown, I eat five dozen eggs, so I'm roughly the size of a barge. Oh, ah, oh, wow. My, what a guy that Gaston. No one shoots like Gaston, makes those beauts like Gaston. Then goes thromping wearing, around wearing boots like Gaston. I use antlers in all of my decorating. My, what a guy that Gaston. Oh! So, this guy's just blowing Gaston verbally. Pretty much. That's what friends are for from the Jungle Book. Where are your friends? Where are your friends? Oh, Where are your friends? Oh, yeah. Did you beat him? Yeah. Her. Yay. And yes. Him. Yay. <laughs> Where are your friends? Where are your friends? Where are your friends to the bitter end? When you're down, who comes around to pluck you up when you are down? When you're outside looking in, who's there to open the door? That's what friends are for. Who's always eager to extend a friendly claw? That's what friends are for. And when you're lost in dire need who's at your side at lightning speed where friends of every creature come down the pike in fact we've never met an animal we didn't like didn't like so you can see we're friends in need and friends in need and friends indeed we'll keep you safe in the jungle forever more that's what friends are for wow that's good those those Gaston's was pretty bad but I was too busy fighting to make fun yeah. of that gotta keep one jump ahead of the red line, one swing ahead of the sword. Oh I steal God. only what I can't afford. That's everything. <laughs> I man. steal everything because I bore. How to be that's a dick 101. No, yeah, pretty much. That guys don't appreciate I'm broke. Free street uh, rough, riff raff, oh, riff raff. Wow. Riff raff street rat scoundrel, take that. Just a little snack, guys. Rip him open, take it back, guys. I can take a hint, gotta face the facts, you're my only friend of Boo. Who? Oh, it's sad, Aladdin's hit the bottom, he's become a one-man rise in crime. I blame his parents, except he hasn't got them. 
gotta eat till what the eat. <laughs> fuck <laughs> who's singing this song again it's a lot that's the crowd of people singing it that oh part. what the f what assholes <laughs> yep gotta eat to live gotta steal to eat I'll tell you more about it when I got time one jump ahead of the slow pokes one skip ahead of my doom next time gotta use a nom de plume one what jump the ahead of the hit fuck man. is a nom de ahead plume of I think it's something in French. You don't have to look it right, up. I'll look it up after this. Yeah. One jump ahead of the hitman, one hit ahead of the flock. I think I'll take a stroll around the block. Stop thief, vandal, outrage, scandal. Let's not be too hasty. Still, I think he's rather tasty. God, gotta eat to live, gotta still to eat, otherwise we'd get along wrong. One jump ahead of the hoof beats, Vandals. One hop ahead of the hump. Street rat. One trick ahead of disaster. Scoundrel. They're quick, but I'm much faster. Take that. Here it goes. Better throw my hand in. Wish me happy land, and all I gotta do is jump. Okay, then. So, nom de plume. Nom de plume. Yeah. <laughs> This is also I blame relevant. his parents, except he hasn't got them. That's gotta be one of the most fucked up lines I've ever heard in a Disney film. Oh, oh hooray! I'm reading Savages next. Why is Google not working? Yeah, Google's been a bitch to me lately. Every time I use it or something, it just fucks up. Oh, Nom de, Pu non Nom de Plume is a pen name. In other words, he's gonna use like a different identity. It does it mean pen name or is it a pen it name? It means a pen name. So next time I'm gonna use a nom de plume is means I'm gonna use a pen name. It's gonna be somebody else. Yeah, I got it. I know I know how a pen name works. Savages lyrics. Oh god. Now, just to set the scene for those of you who haven't seen Pocahontas, the song Savages is being sung by the Indians and the Colonials about each other. Murder lives forever and so does war. It's the sur survival of the fittest, rich against the poor. At the end of the day, it's a human trait hidden deep down inside our DNA. One man... Wait a second, this is the song. No, I want the Disney song, Savages, not something by Maria and the Diamonds. The who and the who? Marina and the Diamonds. The who? I don't know. Pocahontas and Savages lyrics. Uh -huh. Shut up. <laughs> oh dear. So what can you expect from filthy li little heathens? Their whole disgusting race is like a curse. Their skin's a hellish red. They're only good when dead. They're vermin Holy as I say it. Holy shit! <laughs> this isn't a Disney film? Yes. Oh. They're savages, savages, barely even human. Savages, savages, drive them from our shore. They're not like you and me. Which means they must be evil. We must sound the drums of war. They're savages, savages. Dirty red skinned devils. Now we sound the drums of war. And now it's the Native American singing. This is what we feared. The pale face is a demon. The only thing they feel at all is greed. Beneath that milky hide, their emptiness inside. I wonder if they can even bleed. They're savages, savages, barely even human. Savages, savages, killers at the core. They're different from they're different from us, which means they can't be trusted. Now we must sound the drums of war. They're savages, savages. First we deal this, first we deal with this one, then we sound the drums of war. Savages, savages. Let's go kill a few men. Savages, savages. Now it's up to you, men. Savages, savages, barely even human. Now we sound the drums of war. Now this is Pocahontas. Is there anything I can do? Will this be? Re will this really be the end? Is it only death that death that waits just around the river bend? Then it's Ratcliffe again. This will be the day. This will be the morning. We will see them dying in the dust. I don't know what I can do. Still, I've got to try. Now this we've is got like to bringing back. up the most disturbing images my mind can create right now. This is this is not the Disney I know. Yeah. Now, just so you know, this little last part is jumping between Ratcliffe, Polhatan, which is Pocahontas' father, and Pocahontas. Now we make him pay. Eagle helped my feet to fly, now without a warning. Mountain helped my heart be great. Now we leave him blood and bone and rust. 
Spirits of the earth and sky, it's them or us. Please don't let it be too late. They're just a bunch of filthy, stinking, savages, savages. Devils, demons, kill them, savages, savages. What are we waiting for? Destroy their evil race until there's not a trace left. How loud are the drums of war? We will sound the drums of war. Savages, savages, now we sound the drums of war. Savages, savages. Now we see what comes of trying to be chums. Now we see the drums of war. Now we see the drums of war. Is the death of all I love carried in the drumming of war? Is it, no, this is Pocahontas, not Dying Fetus, right? Yes. Okay. The very first verse of this song. What can you expect from filthy little heathens? Their whole disgusting race is like a curse. Their skin's a hellish red. They're only good when dead. They're vermin, as I say, and worse. Disney. Kid friendly? You decide. And now Hellfire lyrics from uh, The Hunchback of Notre Dame. I haven't watched that movie in forever, so I don't remember this. I confess to God Almighty, to Blessed Mary Ever Virgin, to Wait, the Blessed is this... Archangel. Uh, is this the one before they try to hang him, or this is um this is uh the villain's song? Oh, okay. Now I'm reading the English translation of the first part because it's a different language in the first part. Yeah. Um, I Probably think it's Italian. French. Why would or it be French? Italian? That would make sense. I don't know. I couldn't think of where Hunter back in Notre Dame was set. No, well, Notre I Dame is God. in France. I know. I couldn't think of where it was. I confess to God Almighty, to Blessed, uh, to Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, to the Blessed Archangel Angel Michael, to the Holy Apostles, to all the saints. Betta Maria, you know I am a righteous man. Of my virtue, I am justly proud. And to you, Father, Betta Maria, you know I am much purer than the common, vulgar, weak, licentious crowd. That I have sinned. Tell me, Maria, why I see her dancing there. Why her eyes, why her smoldering eyes still scorch my soul? In thought I feel her, I see her. The sun caught in raven hair is blazing in and out, is blazing in me out of all control. In word and deed, lake fire, hell fire, this fire in my skin. This burning desire is turning me to sin. It's not my fault through my fault. I'm not to blame through my fault. It's the gypsy girl, the witch who sent this flame. Through my most grievous fault, it's not my fault. Through my fault, in in God's plan, through my fault, He made the devil so much stronger than a man. Through my most grievous fault, protect me, Maria. Don't let the siren cast her spell. Don't let her fire sear my flesh and bone. Destroy Esmeralda and let her taste the fires of hell, or, or else let her be mine and mine alone. Hellfire, dark fire. Now, Gypsy, it's your turn. Choose me or your pyre. Be mine or you will burn. Lord have mercy. God have mercy on her. Lord have mercy, God have mercy on her. Lord have mercy, but she will be mine or she will burn. Well, I gotta say that sums up the Christian standpoint back then. So, good job. Uh, what's another song that's probably very twisted? I don't know why we're doing it purposefully. It was hilarious. It, it, none of these twisted songs are funny because I don't know what the fuck to say to them other than to sit here in complete shock <laughs> because my childhood just went out the fucking window along with my hopes. So think of something like Winnie the Pooh. What's when Winnie you the wish Pooh? upon a star makes no... What? I'm doing When You Wish Upon a Star first. Fine. Winnie the Pooh. When You Wish Upon a Star is coming first. Find you big. When you wish upon a star makes no difference who you are. Anything that your heart desires will come to you. If your heart is in your dream, no request is too extreme. When you wish upon a star let dre like dreamers do. Fate is kind, she brings to those who love the sweet fulfillment of the singing of their secret longing. Like a bolt out of the blue, fate steps in and pulls you through. When you wish upon a star, your dreams come true. Like a bolt out of the blue, it's the same verse again, and that's it. Winnie the Pooh is just Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. Tubby little fluff bear all stuffed with kidneys, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't even know, but you're going to sit here and tell me that it's just something? I accidentally spelled Pooh with two H's and one O at the end. <laughs> <laughs> Winnie the Pooh! <laughs> Someone sacked the narrator as he was... <laughs> <laughs> oh god, they're beating me alive! Please, Jesus, help me! Winnie oh. the Pooh! Winnie the Pooh! Deep. 
deep in the Hundred Acre Woods, where Christopher Robin plays, you'll find the enchanting neighborhood of Christopher's childhood days. A donkey named Eeyore is his friend, and Kanga in Little Rue. There's Rabbit and Piglet, and there's an owl too. But most of all, Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Chubby little chubby, all stuffed with fluff. Who are you, He's fucking Winnie Glenn Beck? Winnie the Pooh. Willy nilly silly old bear. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Chubby little chubby, all stuffed with fluff. He's Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Pooh. Willy nilly silly the old bear. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Chubby little chubby, all stuffed with fluff. He's Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Willy nilly silly old bear. And that's the end. That was the greatest song I ever heard. <laughs> Better than Savages. <laughs> that was I, awesome. I could have sworn we were listening to like Dying Fetus or something. Cannibal Corpse. Cannibal Corpse? Yeah. Bands. Where the fuck did that lizard man go? Oh, there they are. Son of a bitch. I want to do Mad Libs. <sighs> Hold on. Maybe. Well, the Mad Libs is something we do in between and then read the final product in video. Oh! We, we should do that. We should. You're gonna have to do the Mad Libs when I'm doing this, though, when I'm playing, and I'll do them for you when you're playing. Don't do it. Okay. Well, I mean, we're gonna do the Mad Lib in between episodes, and we're gonna start the episode off. No introduction or anything. We're just gonna start it off with the Mad Lib. Okay. Did you say you wanted to update the intro? Eventually. Okay. Well, Alibaba and had them 40 thieves. Shitzer Blah had a thousand tails. But Master, you're in luck, because up your sleeve you've got a brand of magic that never fails. You've got power you got some power in your corner now, some heavy ammunition in your champ in your camp. You got some punch, pizzazz, yahoo and how. See, all you gotta do is rub that lamp, and I'll say, Mr. Aladdin, sir, what be your pleasure be? Let me take pleasure your order. Pleasure be your pleasure be? Yeah, let me take your order and jot it down. You ain't never had a friend like me. Life is your restaurant, and I'm your maitre d. Come on, whisper what it is you want. You ain't never had a friend like me. Yes, sir, we pride ourselves of service. You're the boss, the king, the saw. Say what you wish, it's yours, true dish. How about a little more baklava? Have some of column A, try more of column B. I'm in the mood to help you, dude. You ain't never had a friend like me. Oh my, oh no, no, my, my, my. Can you friends do this? Can your friends do that? Can your friends pull this out their little hat? Can your friends go poof? Well, looky here. Can your friends go abracadabra, let her rip, and make the sucker disappear? So don't just sit there slack jaw bug-eyed. I'm here to answer all your midday prayers. You've got me bona fide certified. You've got a genie for charged affairs. I've got a powerful urge to help you out, so what you wish, I really want to know. You've got a list three miles long, no doubt. Well, all you gotta do is rub like so and oh. Mr. Aladdin, sir, I have a wish or two or three. I'm on the job to help Big Nabob. Big what? <laughs> Big Nabob? Big what? You ain't never had a friend like me. Never had a friend. You ain't never had a friend. Never had a friend. You ain't never had Why a friend Why do you like just me. breeze a by friend. shit? Why can't you? What the <laughs> fuck is Nabob? <laughs> I don't know what Nabob is. I'm on the job, you big Nabob. Did they create a word just to fucking make it work? It was Robin Williams, so probably. He did that a lot. But he was awesome. Yeah, he was pretty sweet. Stop running away from me. Poor unfortunate souls from The Little Mermaid. Oh, I want the lyrics, not the video. I want the video. 
four unfortunate souls lyrics. <sighs> the only way to get what you want is to become a human yourself. Can you do that? My dear sweet child, that's what I do. It's what I live for. To help unfortunate mere folk like you. Poor souls with oh, no one to turn to. Oh, son of a bitch. What? This fight. This is the doppelganger fight. You're fighting Dante from Dante's Inferno! Eat him alive! I'm gonna waste... Get his whip. No. Aw. Son of a bitch. I admit that in the past I've been a nasty. Son of a fucking fuck you! What? He's slapping me, like, a, like in ways that I can't do anything about it. He had me in a corner and just wet whipping the fucking shit out of me. Uh, that's what she said. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. They were kidding when they called me. Well, a witch. But you'll find that nowadays, I've mended all my ways, repented, seen the light, and made a switch. True? Yes. And I fortunately know a little magic. It's a talent that I have always possessed. And here lately, please don't laugh, I use it on my on behalf. Of the miserable, lonely, and des desperate, depressed, pathetic, poor, unfortunate souls in pain and need, the one longing to be thinner, that one wants to get the girl. Do I help them? Yes, indeed. These poor unfortunate souls, so sad, so true. They come flocking to my cauldron, crying, Spells, Ursula, please! And I help them, yes I do. Now, it's happened once or twice, someone couldn't pay the price. And I'm afraid I had to rake them across the coals. Yes, I've had the old co odd compl complaint. But on the whole, I've been a saint. To those poor unfortunate souls, have we got a deal? If I become humor, I'll never get to see my... If I become humor... <laughs> become human. I'll never see my father or sisters again. That's right, but you'll have your men. Oh, there we <laughs> go. <laughs> Life's full of tough choices, isn't it? <laughs> oh, and one <laughs> and there's one more thing. We haven't discussed the subject of payment. You can't get something for nothing, you know. But I don't have... I'm not asking for much. Just a token, really. A trifle. You'll never even miss it. What I want from you is your voice. But without my voice, how can I... You have your looks, your pretty face. You don't under... It's you don't un underestimate the importance of body language. Ha! <laughs> the men up there don't like a lot of blabber. They think a girl who gossips is a bore. Yes, on land, it's much preferred for ladies not to say a word. And after all, dear, what is idle prattle for? Come on, they're not all that impressed with conversations. Your gentlemen of true gentlemen avoid it when they can. But they dot and swoon and fawn on the ladies who's withdrawn. If, she's ho if she who holds her tongue who gets a man. Come on, you poor unfortunate soul. Go ahead and make your choice. I'm a very busy woman. I haven't got all day. It won't cost much. Just put your voice, you poor unfortunate soul. It's sad but true. If you want to cross the bridge, my sweet, you've got to pay the toll. Take a gulp and take a breath. Just go ahead and sign the scroll. Float some jetsam, and now I've got her, boys. The boss is on Float a roll. Float some jetsam. Those are the names of her eels. Oh. The boss is on a roll, this poor unfortunate soul. What? Beluga Savruga, come winds of the Capesian Sea, Laryngix Glashtusius, et Max Larnigitius La Voke to me? Now sing! Ah! Keep singing! <laughs> 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 Just looks at the paper, has a stroke. <laughs> Drops dead. <laughs> ah, it keeps singing. <laughs> Actually, you know what? That does sound like you would have a stroke. Because you do say a, a bunch of nonsensical bullshit. Before you're, that's a sign of a stroke. Seriously, what is Beluga Savaga come winds of the... Carpesian Sea. Carpesian. Larkrix Glatusius et Max Larknictasius Lav Voke to me? They're words, Gerald. It's called fashion. Look it up. <laughs> words. Now fashion. <laughs> the 
the fuck was that? Corvo came in for a minute. Uh. <laughs> hey, Corvo! <laughs> Still can't understand that motherfucker. I can. He said, <laughs> <laughs> My head hurts from screaming so much. Well, stop screaming. <laughs> Maybe stop saying stuff that makes me want to scream. Oh, that one. Have you heard the wolf cry to the blue corn moon? Actually, let's be more let's be more realistic. Have you ever heard the wolf cry at the blue tortillas corn moon? Blue corn tortillas moon. Correction. Don't make me have to whip out a tomato. A wow. Yeah. <laughs> A what? I don't know. A what? I don't know. <laughs> A what? I will kill you where you stand next time on Playing With Power. How long has this episode been going on? 26 minutes. Oh, we still have four minutes. No, we don't. We stop at 20 minutes. We're six minutes over. Why do we start doing that again? So we'd have more time to do more episodes. But, but, I haven't done anything. You beat your doppelganger! Does that count as a thing? Yes! Are you sure? Yes. Next time on Playing With Power. Madlib!